a group of women in Anambra State last week staged a very peaceful protest against how they are being forced to drink the water used in washing their husband's dead body. Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you all doing? Hope you guys are keeping safe. Today we'll be talking about how women are being subjected to some practice or in the name of tradition in some part of Nigeria. In one of my videos, I talked about how to respect your culture and tradition, which is a way of life of the people. And I also emphasized on how people use this tradition to commit evil acts to wicked others. They hide on that tradition to wicked other people and this particular practice that we're going to talk about is one of the evil ones that they do i'm not here to condemn anyone's tradition i'm not here to condemn anyone's culture i believe in tradition i believe in culture but the good ones not the bad ones when it is wrong it is wrong i am against the ones that are wrong because what is wrong is wrong these women demand the stop of the ritual where the, the where they have to wash or clean their husband's dead body and give them the water to drink all in the name of proving their innocence and it's not expected from the man i'm the one that added that one but truly it's not expected from the man the women did not protest i'm the one that is saying this one now i celebrate those women especially the chairperson of the agency on violence against person prohibition act in anambra state in person of Ms. Hope Okoye, hmm, women need to speak more because this act is one of the bad and worst of them all. Women go through all in the name of proving innocence. Brother will kill brother, but the wife will be the one to be accused. A husband will hide his sickness from his wife and when he dies, the wife will be the one to be accused. Hmm, just please make it make sense. But when the woman dies, even when they know that the husband killed the wife, this act is not nothing. When the woman dies, they don't care what killed the woman, they'll just bury her. Does that mean that the life of the woman is nothing? Anyway, let's not go to that. People have to understand that this is wrong. Medically, it is wrong. Mentally, it is wrong. It is wrong in all areas. It can actually cause sickness for the woman. And when it causes sickness for the woman now, they will come out to say that she felt sick because she's guilty. People must also understand that some of these practices were brought by our forefathers at that time to please them at that time because they do not know better at that time. Now, we know better. We are, we are modifying things. We are changing the narrative. Let's favors us that is good for us that makes us comfortable and still the ones that is harmful to us the kings has to sit up and do the needful men too have to add their voice to this cause for them to stop this act women women i have always said it that these women supporting women women supporting women now multi day women actually do not support women because most of these acts being practiced being encouraged are from women women are the ones to shave hair women are the ones to do this water ritual that i'm talking about women are the ones to be dragging the woman pushing the woman's head accusing her of these things women are the ones to humiliate their fellow woman who just lost her husband ask yourself what if you are that woman ask yourself what if your daughter your mother your sister is that woman being humiliated how will you feel but because it's none of your business she's none of she's not your relative you you just encourage it and you push that narrative and say it's tradition to tradition it must pass from generation to generation it is bad it is wrong let's change the narrative again i want to say I wish there would be a law that would be passed that anyone found guilty of such act should be arrested and thrown into the to jail as in jail them, throw them into prison. Let them stay there because they are not supposed to live among us human beings. It's bad. Trust me, it's bad. To humiliate someone, do you know what it means? A dead body, you wash the body, you wash it and give the person water to drink. It's bad. It's wickedness. And it's wrong it's not good 
I love tradition. I love culture. They are beautiful. But at the end of the day, are they harmful to us? Let's choose the one that is good and throw away the ones that is bad, that is harmful to us. That is what I'm advocating for. You too, you can do so by sharing this video or make a video to talk about it. Let's promote the agenda that this must stop, especially if it happens in your community. This, that is where they say women support women. Not women supporting women and fighting. Like See you guys in my next video. Bye.